A. It's Nate at the Common a Common Good City Farm. I'm here in the youth garden doing the leaf video lessons today. Uh, today is our first day working in the youth garden this season, so we got to clear all these weeds and prepare the ground for what we're going to plant. Uh, to start out the spring season, we're going to plant some root vegetables. Uh, we're going to plant radishes, beets, and turnips. So now we've gotten our weeds out the bed and we've removed our mulch from last year. Uh, yeah, I'm just using the rake to uh, even the ground out and pull out any of these other grass, you know, few roots. This crabgrass is still in the bed. Um, and we also get like a pretty good look at the soil. We get to see how healthy it is. All of these worms we've been seeing while pulling out the uh on the yeah, worms so we know we got some good stuff going here um so yeah evening out the soil and i'm about to about to add some compost and also finish cleaning up putting the last of this stuff with these weeds here um so yeah i'm about to add some compost adding a little bit of compost to this bag here. Um, we added, I think we added some in the fall maybe, probably not, but yeah it's pretty good soil already so it doesn't need too much. Alright so we got our ground ready for planting. We moved just the top little layer off to the side um, and I'm going to take the seeds uh, and just sort of broadcast them out, just spread the seeds out. Um, you don't have to plant these beets or turnips in neat rows. You can just throw them out there, but you will have to thin them out if you want to get um, larger roots. So that's what we'll do. Uh, so I'll start. Let me show you what the seeds look like. These are what beet seeds look like. Yep. Okay. Um, throw these out here. We're going to plant half of this bed with beets and the other half with acolyte turnips. So, and these are what the turnips look like. And the turnip seeds look exactly like kale seeds or collard seeds or broccoli. They're all in the same plant family. They're all brassicas. And now I'm going to take my rake and start covering these up. So we're going to let these, after these sprout, uh, once they get to a certain length, about probably like an inch and a half high, we'll thin them out. When, as we thin them out this year, we're going to try planting uh, some kale seedlings we have uh, amongst the beets and the turnips. Okay. Well, I'm just watering in the seeds now. This is the end of our lesson. So thanks for joining us and uh, be sure to join us for more leaf lessons and youth garden updates in the future. Thank you.